rather be right now than uh, with a group like you that's here to reclaim your ownership of yourself. You do not belong to the imperial federal government of the United States. This is such a beautiful city, and it's such a wonderful day. The weather has been perfect. Wouldn't it be nice to come back to Washington, D.C. someday and look at it as a city where our liberties and our freedoms are protected instead of assaulted on a daily basis? At the other end of this, at the other end of this mall is an amazing building, the U.S. Capitol. It's a symbol of so much that is great, but in the last four, five months, year, it has been a symbol, a symbol of taking away freedoms and enslaving the people of this country, enslaving them to the federal government. Now look, there's all sorts of tax reform ideas. Uh, as Tim said, we have the flat tax, we have the fair tax. What we all know, what we all agree on, standing here today, is that the present system is not working and it must be changed. You, you raise taxes, sure, the legitimate purposes of the federal government must be funded. And there's nobody here that's not willing to pay part of the cost of the legitimate functions of the federal government of the United States. But we do not want to pay for trailers, for racing lawnmowers, for fire departments in Texas. And we do not want the government to come to us and take the money away from us and pay it to people who sit back and just wait for it like it's an entitlement. for you to make one more very important march. It's on November 2nd. It's to your voting precinct. You be there. They're getting the message now, but you be there and you vote. You vote for your freedom, your liberty, and your children and your grandchildren. And I thank you. God bless you and thank you for coming out here.